dark blue as follows. You have uh, Tom Higgins, Tom Sheridan, Paul Ruddy, James Kelly, Noel Keaton, uh, Leamy Stanton, and Amy Stanton. And I see George O'Gannon going down now from the other team to have a chat with them. Uh, I'll let you know which is which in a minute. Uh, George O'Gannon is a... Oli Gannon selection is Oli Gannon in goal. You have George O'Gannon, you have Miol Duffy, you have Chris Kelly, uh, you have Paul Carroll, and you have Amy Kennedy for the team in the red. I'll let you know which is which just in a minute. Oh yeah. And just once again, you have the final of the Corridor Mark Seven Aside League. And one more to add to the team in the blue is that one and only character, Joe Fritz in goal. Leon, Leon, what's the name of your team? And your Arsenal. The team in red is Liverpool. And the team in blue is uh, Arsenal. And once again, I'll go through the Arsenal lineup for you. The Arsenal lineup as follows. Joe Fitzpatrick in goal. You have Noel Keaton. You have Paul Ruddy. You have Leamy Stanton. Eamon Stanton. James Kelly. Tom Higgins. And Tommy Sheridan. And the Liverpool lineup is as follows. Ali Gannon in goal. Michal Duffy. Dougie Barry. Eamon Kennedy. Chris Kelly. George O'Gannon. Paul Carroll and Eamon Duffy. And there are the two teams contesting the seven aside final here at Corner Mark, where the sun seems to be coming out a little bit through the clouds at this stage. Uh, and the referee and linesmen, there's a change of referees, but the linesmen are as follows. The linesmen are as Christy Fitz and Tony Fitz, who has done the third place playoff. And the referee is Pat Foley, who has picked up a third place place in the game or just after seeing and Pat Foley is, will be in charge of the game here today and uh, I see the both teams having an out kick about and chat and a bit of a laugh I, if it is as good as the game just to let you know it seems there's a change of jerseys from the light blue and dark blue they're going blue with the red stripe down the middle and the change is Arsenal. Arsenal are going to change their jerseys. Once again, we'll let you know Arsenal are going to change their jerseys to the blue with the red stripe for the final. set here for the final of the corner mark seven aside Ali Gannon and Leamy Stanton is gone up for the toss off shake hands smiles Pat Foley is asking to call coin is tossed up uh, I don't know who has won the call but the teams are staying as they are linesmen are going to take their positions for the final of this uh, seven aside it looks to be a good side, this Liverpool side, but not putting down Arsenal. I looking through them, they have some good footballers too. I think we could be in for an enjoyable final here today. Uh, Pat Foley is trying to get them arranged. Uh, waiting for the ball. Fritz, will I run through them again? Uh, once again, in case you have missed the beginning, I'll run through the teams quickly. The Liverpool team as follows. Ali Gannon in goal. Dougie Barry. Uh, George O'Gannon. Chris Kelly. Michal Duffy. Eamon Duffy. Paul Carroll. And Eamon Kennedy. Or Joe Kennedy is the Liverpool lineup. And look at my Arsenal team as follows. Joe Fitzpatrick in goal. Eamon Stanton, Leamy Stanton, Noel, uh, Paul Ruddy, James Kelly, Tommy Riley, Tommy Higgins, and Tommy Sheridan is the Arsenal lineup. And starting off, it's a throw in to Liverpool. Liverpool with me all Duffy into Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly 
plays it to Paul Rudy, who Paul Rudy plays a late to the Liverpool half, and now again it comes out to get a first touch of the ball. Pushes the ball across his box, looks up and kicks. It's a good kick down the field, Dougie Barry. George O'Gannon has it now, and Noel Keaton takes it off him. Noel Keaton and George are having a bit of a tussle there. George O'Gannon to Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy plays it up to me. George O'Gannon again. George pushes the ball across, but I think it's a goal kick. No, it's a corner. First corner of the game goes to Liverpool after about two minutes. Paul Carroll going up to take the corner. And already Liverpool has packed their still box. Paul Carroll steps back, kicks it in. Leamy Stanton clears it away. Only to Paul Carroll to find Tommy Sheridan, and it's a throw into Arsenal. Tommy Sheridan throws the ball to Paul Ruddy. Paul Carroll backs away for it. Paul Ruddy comes away with it to Tommy Higgins to Tommy Sheridan Tommy Sheridan back to Tommy Higgins Tom Higgins slows it down turns and it's gone out it's a goal kick to Liverpool Oli Gannon plays the ball Paul Carroll seems to go to take the goal kick Paul Carroll is runs up and he kicks the ball not a great kick out by any means only to fight Mial Duffy all the same in his own half Mial Duffy brings it over here to the right wing and me all Duffy pushes it back to Ali again and again. Ali looks up, then kicks up to find Chris Kelly and Leamy Stanton. But Jojo goes in with the ball and Joe Fitz takes it. Joe Fitz, not a good kick out, only finds Jerry Kennedy of the Liverpool game team. Jojo wins down here. I think it's a free in to Liverpool yes and Paul Carroll it seems is going to be the long kicker for the day he's gone all the way down to take the kick in free kick Paul Carroll runs up to kick the ball puts in the ball good ball head out by Leamy Stanton Ger Kennedy with the ball now I think he's going to let one out she is and it's a throw to Liverpool and Eamon Duffy has gone over to take it. Eamon Duffy with the throw now, throws it to Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll stops it, looks up, finds George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon beats one, beats two, but he doesn't beat the third man, Leamy Stanton. Mial Duffy pushes the ball in and it's gone over and it's a corner to Liverpool. That ever funny character. Joe Fitz in the Arsenal goal. Uh, I think with him on the field alone, we will have a fairly humorous game. It's a corner to, ta to be taken by Paul Carroll. Yes, Paul Carroll kicks it in to find Jojo Gannon. Jojo Gannon hits the upper, hits the crossbar. Liam Stanton takes it down, and it's a it's a corner to to uh, Liverpool. And Paul Carroll going over to the far side now to take this corner. Eamon Stanton cleared it out there. Once again, he's a brotherly Leamy. And you have Michal Duffy and Eamon Duffy on the Arsenal t on the Liverpool team. That's brothers. Paul Carroll kicks in this ball. Good ball in George O'Gannon right as well. Oh, Joe Fitz. Uh, Joe Fitz doing a little bit of acrobat, but he holds on to it. Kicks it up the field to... Uh, Amy Kennedy only finds Tommy Sheridan in return. Tommy Sheridan finds James Kelly in return. James Kelly, a good ball to Tommy Higgins. Tom Higgins loses it to Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy goes well across and it's a throw to uh, it's a throw to Liverpool. Joe Fitz there giving us a little bit of uh, entertainment there uh, down at the other goal. It's a throw into Arsenal, sorry. With Paul Ruddy with the ball. Paul Ruddy throws it in to Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins pushes it back to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy to Tom Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan to Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton, good ball into Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy tried to turn, but Paul Carr blocks him down well. Eamon Duffy with the ball. Eamon Duffy comes away with the ball. Eamon Duffy pushes the ball to George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon pushes the ball through Noel Keaton's legs, and it's a throw to uh, Liverpool. 
He's been told to go back, stealing yards on the line. Throws it to me all Duffy. Me all Duffy takes it down, turns. Paul Ruddy robs him. Paul Ruddy doesn't beat him and Duffy. James Kelly tries to beat him and Duffy, but doesn't succeed. Leamy stand to it the ball now. Leamy coming through. Good ball to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy lets it bounce. Tries to take it, but no. Paul Carroll comes in and kicks it out over the, the line for uh, an Arsenal throw. Leamy stand to throw it up to James Kelly. James Kelly turns to Michael Hig Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins pushes it to me all the way. Not on his own team, and we all pushes it back to Ali Gannon in goal for Liverpool. Good kick by Ali to find Jojo. Jojo kicks it out, and it's an Arsenal throw. Leamy standing going over to get the ball now. Leamy looking up. I see Tommy Sheridan looking for it, but it's Tom Higgins that gets it. Tom Higgins pushes up to me, Old Duffy. Not on his own team, and Ali Gannon once again with the ball. Ali taking his time looking up. Don't that so he's telling someone to move. He kicks the ball up. He kicks it to nobody. Uh, Tommy Sheridan gets it all on his own off the Arsenal team. Uh, me old Duffy, he pushes it back to a man in Liverpool. Me old Duffy takes it down. Me old Duffy going through. Me old Duffy and hard luck by Chris Kelly. It looked to be a good move, but it's a goal kick all the same. Now, we have a fair old crowd gathered here at Corner Mark for this final. And I think it just says a fair bit for football in Westport when you see people interested to come to games like this going back to the game Joe Fitz kicks the ball out kicks a good ball out but it just goes out of play it's a Liverpool throw me all Duffy with the ball me all Duffy throws the ball down to his brother Eamon Eamon turns kicks uh, Leamy Stanton on his own takes it down pushes it forward and kicks a good ball to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy pushes the ball to James Kelly. James Kelly takes it down. Not a great return by no means, but Paul Ruddy somehow still gets it. Back to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan lining up for a shot. But Paul Carroll clears it for Liverpool. George O'Gannon takes it. He's gone inside the Arsenal half. Noel Keaton takes it. Chris Kelly lets it through his legs. And I think they're giving the corner. Chris Kelly wins the corner. Chris Kelly is placing the ball. It's Paul Carroll once again to go out to kick the corner. Exciting enough for their first few minutes. Joe Fitz on the goal line telling his players to mark up. Paul Carroll, no sign of him yet, kicks the ball in now. Good ball to Dougie Barry. Dougie Barry just goes over his head. It's a goal kick. Joe Fitz kicks it out to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan has a bit of room on that side. Kicks a good ball up to Paul Ruddy, but it's gone out of play. It's a Liverpool throw. Eamon. <laughs> Eamon Duffy with the ball now throws it to Mihal. Mihal pushes it back to Eamon. Eamon pushes it up to Chris Kelly, but the bounce beats him. Uh, Noel Keaton throws it to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan loses it to me all Duffy. Me all Duffy to jerk Eamon Kennedy. Eamon Kennedy down to Dougie Barry. Dougie knocks it on well for Jojo Gannon. Jojo turned on it. Uh, Leamy stand to clear some Jojo's shot. Jojo gets it again, but Joe's shouting about someone not being marked. Uh, Tommy Riley, Tommy uh, Higgins clears it up, and Eamon Duffy puts it out. Tom Higgins with the ball now. Tom looks up, takes the throw, finds Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan looks up, finds Paul Ruddy. Nice move. Paul Ruddy beats me all Duffy. Uh, Ali Gannon gets down on it. Uh, Ali Gannon looking to see can he find someone. He's cooling the game down a little bit. Kicks it out. Just over the, the, his own half to find Leamy Stanton to clear it away. Leamy finds Hall off Liverpool, pushes it right across to his brother Eamon off Liverpool. Eamon backing away with James Kelly. Uh, Tommy Higgins with the ball, pushes the ball up to Paul Ruddy, but Paul Carroll, I think, will clear away. It's a throw to, to Arsenal with Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy with the ball. Paul Ruddy with the ball. Takes the throw in. Only to find me all Duffy there to clear again. To find Paul Carroll to push it out more. Chris Kelly takes it down. There's three against two now. A good ball. Hartlock 
a good ball by Chris Kelly, but a little bit too far for uh, Georgia again. And once again, Joe in goal is giving us a little bit of entertainment here. Joe plays the ball, kicks it out. Joe in goal for Arsenal, a team which he supports in the English League as well. And Joe Jigacton, I think, at this stage of the game, kick, kicks it out. Kicks it out. It's cold enough here, up here uh, in Carnivart, for this final. The uh, Liverpool team looks more composed in this earlier half than the Arsenal team. Uh, not a lot of opportunities, but I suppose at the end of the game we won't be seeing that. Eamon Duffy with the ball now, throws the ball in to Jojo again. Jojo pushes it down to Mial Duffy. Mial Duffy pushes it across to find Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly pushes it to Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll prepared to let it run out for a throw. Paul Carroll with the throw, throws it into Mial Duffy. Mial Duffy turns inside the box, pushes it across. Jojo again with the ball. And there's a big scramble on down there. There's a big scramble on down there, but Arsenal somehow gets a clear to it. Paul Ruddy with the ball now on the far side of the field. He's shouting to his players to run on. He kicks the ball up only to find Mio Duffy off Liverpool. Mio gets the ball again off uh, Ger Kendi off Liverpool. Ger pushes it back down again to Tom Higgins of Arsenal. Tom Higgins pushes it back up to Emma Duffy off Liverpool. Emma Duffy pushes it to Ger of Arsenal. Oh, good throw, good throw. Paul Carroll clears away. He's well prepared to give uh, a corner. Uh, there's a fair old crowd gathered here, as I say. Cold but dry. Waiting for the ball now to be retrieved for this corner. Tom Higgins going placing the ball for the corner. There's four Arsenal men in the, the Liverpool box. Tom Higgins kicks it in. Good ball, but Paul Carroll clears away. Uh, Chris Kelly takes the bounce. Chris kicks it down to the Arsenal half. Shawnee Stanton lets it bounce. Paul Carroll coming in, closing fast. And he kicks it away. Paul Carroll to George O'Gannon to me all Duffy. Two of them, not an Arsenal man in sight at the moment. George O'Gannon tears down through them all, but Leamy Stanton takes it away. Leamy's closing it, gone into the Liverpool half. Good ball up, good ball. And Ollie Gannon comes out and gives it away for a throw. Uh, I think it's the first bit of a real excitement we had in that half, in this half. Uh, James Kelly with the throw now. James Kelly throws it in to find Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy. Tussling with me all Duffy. Good ball by James Kelly, but Ali takes it. No real pressures on him, but takes it well. Finds Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly who lets the ball run out of play. Leamy Stanton with the throw out up to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan takes it down. Looks. Not a great kick only to find Eamon Duffy of Liverpool. But Leamon puts it back to Tommy of Arsenal. Tommy gives it back to James Kelly, who is off Arsenal. Oh James Kelly sights this ball. Has a shot, but Paul Carroll blocks it down. Uh, Dougie and Eamon Duffy uh, get mixed up only to concede the throw to Paul Carroll. Uh, Paul Woody with the throw into Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton a high ball and nobody there at all. Tom Higgins running for it. Tom Higgins has got it. Tom Higgins pushes the ball to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan beats one, pushes it back to Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins going through and uh, George O'Gannon has to come all the way back to push it away for a, for a throw or a corner and that is the second or third corner Arsenal is after having in the last 10 minutes. And I see James Kelly has gone out to take the uh, corner now. Kicks in a good ball. Good ball. Ollie Gannon at sea. And Tom Higgins a back head kick only to go out. But Ollie Gannon had, was at sea for that corner. A good corner by James Kelly. James, I think, is the Eunice player uh, taking part taking part in this final here today. Uh, 16, I think he's ages, or 17. But by all means, he's the Eunice player, and I tell you, not a bad one. Ali Gannon placed the ball to 
Paul Carroll, Paul Carroll taking the ball now, he's going to place it. Paul Carroll places the ball. Paul Carroll kicks it out, well over his own half at the Darfton half, only to find Eamon Stanton to clear it back. Eamon Stanton finds Eamon Duffy who gives it away to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy doesn't beat Ger Kennedy. Ger Kennedy leaves it to Meol Duffy. Meol Duffy takes it inside his own half. He has to go backwards with it to find Ger again. Ger pushes it forward again. And I think it's a throw to Arsenal, yes. Paul Ruddy with the throw. Uh, whistle blowing a foul throw, I think it is. Foul throw. Me old Duffy with the ball now for Liverpool. Pushes the ball, throws the ball to Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly pushes the ball into George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon kicks it away and it took a deflection of Tom Higgins for a throw for Liverpool. Inside their, inside the Arsenal half, about 10, 15 yards inside the Arsenal half. Joe Fitz not having a lot to do in the other goal. Ali Gannon kept warm enough in the Liverpool goal, but doing his job, and that's what counts. Me all Duffy with the throw now, in Tim McKinney. Uh, Sean Stanton miscues it. Oh, there's a bit of miss kick in there. Dougie Barry and Jojo getting confused. And just wide by Paul Carr from about 20, 25 yards out. And it's just went wide. Joe Fitz having a laugh down there in the Arsenal goal. And it's a goal kick. <laughs> Joe Fitz having a laugh down there. That's never ready, Joe, to have a laugh at anything. Kicks it out. Not a bad kick at all. Only to fight George again. It does to give a great header. But me all, Eamon Duffy does. Uh, handballed by Eamon Stanton. Or Leamy Stanton. Paul Carroll uh, placing the ball. I think with Dougie Barry, I see, gone in in front of the goalie, Noel Keaton on the, the left-hand post. Paul Carroll sided it up. Good kick. Hits the post from about 30 yards out. Paul Ruddy takes it away. Uh, going up. Ball bounces a little high. Good ball. James Kelly puts it on. That's three moves that Tommy Sheridan just ke couldn't keep up with it. A good move. But what an effort by Paul Carroll from about 30 yards out. A good shot. And now we have him here again placing the ball to take a goal kick. He's taking the corners. He's taking the goal kicks. He's taking the freeze. Paul Carroll stands back. Looks up. And kicks. Good ball up to find George again. A free, a free out against George O'Gannon. A bit of pushing. Noel Keaton kicks a good ball up to find Paul Carroll ever ready here again to clear out. A throw to Arsenal. I see Pat Foley giving us a smile here as well. Paul Ruddy with the ball. Throws the ball but only finds Meal Duffy the, the Liverpool team. Meal Duffy comes out through two of them with the ball and Eamon Duffy ever ready to support him. It's a goal kick to uh, Liverpool. Once again, guess who, who's going to take the kick out? Yes, Paul Carroll. Chris Kelly looking for it down this way. Paul Carroll kicks it up to find Meol Duffy. Meol Duffy nods it back, only to find Tommy Sheridan. Joe Fitz comes to it now. Oh, but no, Keaton. It's gone about two inches of break in the window. What a, what a clearance. I think it's Mr. Uh, Dennis Harris's that would, uh, would have been finding the football in the beds nowhere. No, Keaton making no mistake about his clearance. Joe Fitz was coming out to get the ball, but it was cleared away. Uh, we have saw two efforts now of hitting the uh, crossbar off the Arsenal goal. Ali Gannon, as I say, not having a lot to do, doing it well. Uh, Joe Fitz, a little bit under pressure. Liverpool seems to have the edge of this first half. Waiting for the, waiting for the ball to be retrieved now. And the ball's back on the field. But I don't know what the problem seems to be. There is a problem. Referee's holding the ball. 
I think it's a player they're waiting for it to come back. It is. No, it's the linesman, Christy Fritz. Jojo Gannon with the ball now to take a throw in. Throws the ball in to fight me all Duffy. In return, there's only can it be my, uh, Tom Higgins. Amos Stanton kicks it up to find Paul Carr at Arsenal time. Uh, Paul Carr pushes it back again. Paul Carr, another kick in to find uh, Leamy Stanton, and it's gone wide. It's a goal kick for Arsenal. Joe Fitzpatrick at the ball now, placing the ball for Arsenal. He's looking up. Joe kicks. A good kick. A good kick. Leaves Paul Carroll in a little bit of trouble, but Ollie Gannon cleans up behind him. A good kick by Joe Fitzpatrick. Ollie in return kicks the long ball down, only to find Amos Stanton that pushes his way to an, uh, a free in. Yes, pushing by Amos Stanton on Michal Duffy of Liverpool. Paul Carroll once again uh, placing the ball. I wonder where we have another shot. I see one, two, three, four, four Liverpool men in that box. Good ball and Paul Woody heads it away. Paul Woody heads it away. I think it's a corner. No, it's a goal kick. Jojo Gannon must have touched it. Going out, kicks it up to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan gets his shot blocked by uh, Paul Carroll, but he gets it again, kicks it up to Paul Woody. Paul Ruddy, Paul Ruddy, Paul Ruddy beats Ger. Oh, and Ali Gannon takes with no real pressure on him at all. Kicks it out to find Jojo Gannon. Jojo Gannon down to Leamy Stanton. Jojo gets it again back from Leamy. And they're not with each other, by the way. Uh, to find Amos Stanton and Chris Kelly not with each other. Uh, Chris, nice ball to Paul Carroll. Nice return by Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll, nice back, but Joe Fitz takes it. Good throw. Good show. Uh, Tommy Sheridan only finds Paul Carroll at Liverpool. Paul Carroll sizes it up. Paul Carroll takes a drive and Lima Stanton heads it away. Noel Keaton tries to clear it, doesn't collect it well, but James Kelly, I think, will clear it for them. James has it inside his own half. A good ball. A good ball. Oh, and Paul Carroll once again, once again clears. I think Ollie once again. A little bit slow, but it was cleared. A corner to Arsenal. Uh, James Kelly to take another corner. Ali not too sure of himself. I think it's a little bit of a build-up. Good kick in by, by James Kelly, only to be cleared once again by Paul Carroll. Uh, Noel Keaton with the ball now. Noel puts it back in again. Uh, high foot by high foot by Paul Ruddy on me, Hull Duffy. But I don't think there was anything meant to work. <laughs> and I hear Chris Kelly telling his team he wants a goal. Uh, Paul Carroll once again to take the kick out. Since Paul Carroll seems to be the key man in this, this Liverpool team. Paul Carroll runs back to kick it up, kicks up a good ball to find George O'Gannon to nod it on. To Joe Fitzpatrick, who lets it bounce but takes it no trouble. Tommy Sheridan with the ball now. Tommy kicks the ball up. Tommy kicks the ball up and it goes out of play. I think there is a little bit of nerve, nerves out there today. Goal kick. I see Paul Carroll putting a little lump in the ground so he can kick it all again in his place. And, and Paul once again goes back to kick it out. Paul Carroll looking up, a good kick, a good kick. No one there reading it, and Tommy Sheridan just lets it out for a throw-in. Throw-in to Arsenal, bad throw by Tommy Sheridan. George O'Gannon with the ball, Leamy Stanton clears it for Arsenal. Paul Ruddy coming down, and Mial Duffy coming in closing on him. They're coming up the side of the field, Paul Ruddy gets the better off the exchange, pushes the ball across. But he's not beat, beat the other Duffy. He is, he's gone through, and Ali Gannon cleans up at the back, behind. Ali Gannon kicks it up, only to fight Noel Keaton of Arsenal, that puts it back up to Tommy Sheridan of Arsenal. Tommy chips, nice little push around Jerkin, Jerkin, and it's gone out of play. 
No, he pushes it, pushes it, and they go pushing it across to the goalie. And there's a fair old, uh, there's a appeals for a penalty, I think. But uh, James Kelly plays on, not paying no heat to it. A good ball to. Uh, I think myself, he could have took down Noel Keaton. And Chris Kelly at the other end nods it down, only to find Joe Fitz there. Joe Fitz kicks the ball up, only to find him and Duffy. Him and Duffy finds George O'Gan and George O'Gan and pushes it away. But the whistle is gone. Noel Keaton takes the ball, pushes the ball to uh, Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan finds Paul Ruddy, James Kelly in. But now all the Liverpool men are coming back. Paul Ruddy beats Paul Carroll. Oh. James Kelly just couldn't get his foot to it. The Liverpool team now doesn't look too steady. After we seen earlier, they look to have the edge. It's touch and go at this stage of the game. Ollie Gannon, bad kick out. Oh, bad kick out. And it's gone all the way back. But it's gone all the way down to the Arsenal goal at this stage. George O'Gannon beating Liam Stanton. He's going well. George o Joe Fitz takes well from George O'Gannon. George o Fitz defines James Kelly. Oh, and the bouts catches Tommy Sheridan completely. Eamon Duffy prepared to hold it in down there. Pushes the ball down to nobody. Leamy Stanton on his own. Chris Kelly now going over to him. Leamy pushes it to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan gives it to Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton pushes it back up to James Kelly. Jer Kennedy is keeping James under tabs. Noel Keaton pushes the ball back up. Only fight Eamon Duffy in Liverpool. Eamon Duffy finds... Liam Stanton of Arsenal, that's gone back to Paul Dougie Barry, gone back to him and Duffy now at Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly out on the wing. Uh, Chris Kelly beats Noel Keaton. Chris Kelly go puts in a great ball, uh, but they're prepared to let it out for a corner. They're not too sure down there in the Arsenal uh, back line. They have forgot their communications, right? Paul Carroll going out to take the uh, Liverpool corner. I think it's the third or fourth in this half. There's one, two, three, four, five. There's five Liverpool players down there. All the Arsenal players down there. Good ball in. Goes out. Dougie Barry rises over everyone. Only to head it out to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan gets the ball. Sends the ball up to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy does not collect it. Me old Duffy does. Pushes it down to Tommy Higgins of Arsenal. Arsenal up. Paul Ruddy gone through again. Paul Ruddy gone. And... And Arsenal has opened the score with a great goal by Paul Ruddy. He comes up the left wing, Ollie Gannon comes out to narrow angle and he pushes the ball over Ollie. The score is 1-0 to Arsenal. I don't think Arsenal was the favourites to uh, take this uh, cup here today, but I'll tell you if they have anything to say about it, It'll be a different story at the end of the game. It's a pass off now. George O'Gannon over the ball. Pushes the ball to Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll takes the drive and it's gone out. And once again, you see Joe Fitz uh, jig acted out there, trying to entertain the people that's here and he's doing a good job. Joe Fitz with the ball after No Keaton pushing it back, pushes up a good ball. Paul James Kelly through. Oh, hard luck, James Kelly. A nice little effort, first time. But I think Ollie had a cover on the post. Ollie placing the ball. Paul Carroll going down once again to uh, take the kick. Now we have a little game on our hands. 1 0 to Arsenal. Uh, the score of Paul Ruddy. I think you could call it an individual goal. Paul Carroll kicks the ball out. Tommy Sheridan heads it away. Eamon Kindy, Joe Kindy with the throw to find Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy back to Gerard. Gerard to find George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon pushes it to Dougie. Dougie pushes it back to George. George with Don Fear out running around here. Finds me all Duffy. Finds a oh, nice one, two between them all the way. Oh, Joe Fitz blocks down well with his hand. Spoils it well with his hand. Good ball up. Paul Woody once again takes it. Oh, great ball to James Kelly. Good save, Ollie Gann. Oh, James Kelly gets the rebound, but hits the post. Paul Carroll clear. Hurt luck, James Kelly. Ollie Gannon blocks well. Ball comes loose to James Kelly. James Kelly, in return, hits the upright. And Paul Carroll, happy enough to clear from Tommy Sheridan that was coming in. Ball gone out. 
Now, the Liverpool defence doesn't look too too settled here. I thought all right looking at Oli in the earlier minutes of the game, he wasn't a bit sure. Maybe he hasn't just settled down yet. Throw to Arsenal, Arsenal takes the throw and two of them go for it and a mix up only to find uh, Chris Kelly that clears it down only to find Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton beats Michal Duffy. Noel Keaton gives a bad ball to Chris. To nobody really, but Chris Kelly found it. Tommy Sheridan takes it down. Tommy with the ball now in there. Liverpool half. Good ball. Uh, Paul Carroll stops Paul Woody from having a shot and it's gone out for an Arsenal throw. In shot now, I think you can see Tommy Sheridan and Tony Fitz looking for the ball, but they have a few ball boys over there to collect to collect the ball from them. Tommy Sheridan with the ball now, throws the ball to James Kelly. James Kelly causing a fair bit of trouble in this game, and I think James Kelly gets a free for a handball, I think it is. There's one, two, three, there's only three Arsenal players in that box, and all Liverpool. Uh, Tommy Sheridan over the ball now. Tommy puts in a good ball just over. Another goal kick for uh, Liverpool. Uh, Ali Gannon. Inside. Paul Carroll takes the kick out. Jojo Gannon finds the ball. Back to Joffrey. Tommy Sheridan with the ball. Pushes the ball up to Tom. James Kelly goes through again, but a little bit too hard. And it's a goal kick for Liverpool. Just to remind you again, the score here in the Corner Mart 7 SI final is Arsenal 1, Liverpool 0. And just to repeat, on if you didn't see the first game, third place playoff was Forest 3, Spurs 2, Forest 4, Spurs 2. Handball. Free <laughs> uh, in, it seems. Uh, long kick out by Paul Carroll to find a little bit of a handball down at the Arsenal box. Uh, free in, free in at the edge of the box. Dougie Barry for Liverpool gone in on the right hand post. Uh, Noel Keaton on the left hand post and Joe Fitz, the Arsenal goalie in the centre. The wall is Paul Ruddy, Leamy Stanton and Tommy Sheridan making the wall and the min over the ball is Jojo Gannon and Michal Duffy. The referee wants them back to the 10 yards, they're gone back. George O'Gannon over the ball. I think he's going to have a shot. I think they're going to have a shot. George O's standing over the ball. The wall a little disorganised. George o with the shot and it's in. And the score is 1 all. A free kick by George O'Gannon to bring the score back to 1 all. And the score now is 1 all. And I think we could have a. An exciting second half. George O'Gannon scored the Liverpool goal. Arsenal takes the pass off only to find George O'Gannon to block it. Paul Ruddy kicks it away. George O'Gannon with the throw now. George O'Gannon stealing a few yards down here, I see. Finds Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy finds Jojo. Jojo hanging over the ball to find me, old Duffy. Neil Duffy finds his brother Eamon, but Eamon lets it through his legs to find Tommy Shudder falling over the wall. Eamon has a shot. Neil Duffy nods the line. Oh, great save by Joe Fitzpatrick. Joe Fitzpatrick came out well and saved it with his legs. He may be the funny man on the Arsenal team, but let me tell you, he sure knows what he's doing when he's standing between the sticks. Paul Carroll gone out to take the corner now. I see four Liverpool players in it. Dougie Barry looking for a good ball across. All the way, Dougie Barry just rubs off his head and goes wide. <laughs> Goal kick now for Arsenal. Charlie Keaton placing the ball, looking up. He's going to take it himself. Joe Fitzpatrick looks to be a little bit sore on one of his legs. Noel Keaton kicks it up only to find Damon Duffy and me all Duffy after the Liverpool team. Tommy Higgins for the Arsenal team plays the ball out to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan slips into defence. Uh, throw in to uh, Liverpool with Eamon Duffy. Eamon throws it to his brother Mihal. Mihal 
tries to beat James Kelly, but it's half time, and the half time scores is Liverpool 1, Arsenal 1. Arsenal open the score with Paul Woody and George O'Gannon with about six, seven minutes to go. Got a free kick for uh, for Liverpool, and the score is 1 all. <laughs> Ripper off West for the night at Youths, and uh, I think he just wants to say, uh, turn around, Mark. He wants to say a few words to you on the behalf of the uh, West United Youth Committee and Senior Committee. Well, first of all, I would like to say I'm very impressed with the arrangement that has been made by the Gotham Art Committee. Not alone, not alone for their own pitch here, but for the all the work that they do for the youth of the town as regards supplying this pitch for their for our local leagues. When I say this, I'm speaking on all on all on behalf of all the committee and I am proud to be associated with them and indeed all the Gohanna Math boys that are here. Uh, just like to thank Merton for uh, running the uh, local lads here for the uh, Morning Leagues and I think he does a great job and I think he deserves a, a little bit more support. Merton, do you want to tell us how you think the game is going to finish? Yes, uh, my own estimation is that the game will go one goal, possibly two goals will win the game. Okay. I think the best chance is for And the second half is just after we start. Uh, thanks again to Mark Game for saying a few words. And once again, he does do a, a great job with the Westport United under 11s and I think he deserves a fair bit of credit but going back to the game here now the score is one all to Liverpool and Arsenal Arsenal in the red uh, Arsenal in the blue Liverpool in the red and it's Eamon Duffy now with the ball to find a gun out of of his brother Michal Tommy Sheridan with the ball for Arsenal throws it down just to find Eamon Duffy Meal finds Jojo. Jojo pushes the ball across to Chris Kelly. Chris Kelly comes down it, but Eamon Stanton clears it away to fight Meal Duffy. Meal Duffy pushes it back in. Leamy Stanton back now to cover. James Kelly coming to take the ball now here. Uh, he cannot beat Chris Kelly, and it's a throw in to uh, Arsenal. James Kelly with the ball. A good ball to uh, Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy beats Jer. Beats. Uh, uh, Ger Kennedy, Paul with a good throw in, a high foot, a high foot, and it's a free out to uh, Liverpool. Joe now up in the, the, uh, my uh, right hand goal for the second half, who had a fairly good game in the first half, made one or two good saves, uh, holding his own. Uh, and you see now Paul Carroll with the free out. Paul Carroll kicks up a high ball, I think it's out. Yes, bounced out of play. Eamon Stanton with the ball. Eamon throws it down to find James Kelly. James doesn't make contact. Eamon Duffy is standing behind him to take it. Eamon takes it, standing on the wing. Uh, good ball up the wing. Uh, kept in by Eamon Stanton. Eamon Stanton hits it off me all Duffy to go out for an Arsenal throw. Pat Forty, just remind you, is taking charge of this game, who has took a third place play third place trophy in the game previous, Tony Fitz and Christy Fitz has done the line in both games. Once again it's the final of the Cardinal Mart seven aside. The score is one all to Arsenal and Liverpool with me all Duffy with Eamon Duffy with the ball. Eamon plays it to me or me all plays it back to Eamon. Eamon pushes across to Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll lets it run. Noel Keaton goes out. Noel Keaton goes uh Like. Uh, a throw in to Arsenal with uh, Noel Keaton. Joe Fitz looking for it and he gets it. 
Joe takes it, looks up, kicks. Good ball down to James Kelly. James Kelly doesn't get up, Michal Duffy does. And Dirk Hindley happy enough to kick it out for a uh, throw to Arsenal. James Kelly with the ball, throws the ball to Tommy Higgins. Tom Higgins does play a good ball. Eamon Duffy takes it off a push. Tom takes it back, Eamon, and it's gone out for a goal kick. <laughs> it's a throw to uh, Liverpool. Sun once again has tried to come out through the clouds, but there is a bit of a wind here. A fair out crowd. There is a good crowd here to see the final of the seven aside. Uh, Joe Fitz once again up there having a, a laugh with a few of them. Dever. <laughs> Dever, re Dever ready. Uh, Joe Fitz to have a laugh. I've been just told here that the replay is at Main Road on Wednesday night if it's a draw here tonight. Uh, Joe Fitz coming out for the ball. Oh, misses it completely. Joe kind of puts in a good ball. And it's just over, over the top. Joe comes out a bit of a mix-up with Noel Keaton. But does it cause a lot of trouble? You think that there's chances going big in here, which there is. Noel Keaton kicks it out to find Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan in return lets it bounce off him and it goes out for a Liverpool throw. Uh, once again the score is one all if you're just after coming in. Paul Ruddy with a great individual goal and George O'Gana with a free with about seven minutes to go. George O'Gana with the ball now again as a big back to me old Duffy. Me old Duffy goes through but James Kelly deprives him and kicks it out. It's a throw to Liverpool, Eamon Duffy goes over to take the ball. Mihal goes out to him. Takes it down, Eamon. Mihal takes it himself, puts it in. James Kelly pushes away only to find Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy stands on it, tries to beat Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan, happy enough to concede a, a corner. I see Paul Carroll going out to take it. There's one, two, three, four, five. There's five Liverpool men in the Arsenal box. There's two, there's five, there's six. There's seven. The whole seven of the Arsenal team are defending at this stage of the game. Paul Carroll puts in a good ball. Joe Fitz comes and takes it. Goes, gives a good throw to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan looks up. Looks up and kicks it out. I think he wanted to play it to Tommy Higgins, but the ball with the wind was carried away. Foul throw by Ger Kennedy. Ger James goes down now to take the throw for Arsenal. James Kelly takes the throw into Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy pushes it back to James Kelly. James Kelly beats me all Duffy, beats Ger Kennedy. Oh, but him and Duffy deprived Paul Ruddy of it. Me all Duffy takes it away. Me all Duffy comes up the wing. A good ball into uh, to Dougie Barry, but just a little bit too hard for Dougie to get. Joe kicks a good ball down to find Paul Carroll to clear it away. Paul Ruddy gone inside there, Liverpool half. Gives a ball to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan to James Kelly, but too hard, Tommy. A little too hard. Throw to Liverpool. Uh, Ger Kindy goes out for it. Throws the ball. Foul throw once again. That's two throws consecutively. He has fouled on, and Tommy Sheridan this time goes down to take the throw for for Arsenal. Tommy Sheridan with the ball now. Tommy throws in a long ball to Paul Ruddy, to Tommy and Ollie. Tom Higgins had the shot, but Ollie Gannon body behind it and takes it well. Noel Keaton, up and under, goes back after this again and throw to Liverpool. George Gannon with the ball. Foul throw by George. That's three consecutive foul throws by the Liverpool team. Tommy Sheridan once again with the throw. <laughs> Another foul throw. That's four throws on a trot that has been fouled. Michal Duffy with the ball now for Liverpool. Throws the ball up and it's gone out for an Arsenal throw. <laughs> Noel Keaton with the ball now. 
throws the ball to James Kelly of the Arsenal team, plays it back to Tommy Sheridan, Tommy Sheridan up to Paul Woody, but Paul Carroll clears it out. James Kelly just half gets it. Mayall Duffy makes him pay. Good ball in, good ball in. And Joe Fitzpatrick clears it up. Good ball to Paul Woody. Paul Woody kicks it down. Uh, Paul Carroll there to clear. No, he doesn't. Is this a chance for Mike? Oh, a chance at its beginning, and Tom Higgins kicks it wide. Oh, yes, I think there's chances going for the begging now at this stage, but no one seems to be able to put them away. Tom Higgins was in the clear there and kicks the ball out at the left hand post, right hand post. Ollie Gannon places the ball now for the goal kick. It looks like Paul Carroll is going to take it. Paul, who hit the bar in the first half with about 25 yards shot out. Kicks the ball up to find Dougie Berry. Dougie plays a lout and it's a throw to Arsenal. Noel Keaton calling his goalie but changes his mind and puts it down. Only to find Damon Duffy. Paul Ruddy, Tommy Sheridan and it's gone out and it's a Liverpool throw. Me all Duffy with the ball now. Going to take the Liverpool throw. Throws the ball up to George again, only to find Tommy Shaw there to Robert. Tom Higgins and Paul Carroll goes for it. Paul Carroll gets the better off the exchange and throws it, kicks it out for the throw. Tom Higgins with the throw now for Arsenal to find Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan beats me all Duffy, puts in a ball, nobody there, and Ali comes out to kick. A fair out kick up the ball, only to find Leamy Stanton that lets it bounce off his leg and out. Chris Kelly with the throw now for Liverpool. Uh, Jojo takes it well, uh, going up the wing. Uh, I cannot see from here what's happening. Oh, Joe Fitz with a one-handed save, and he clears it and he kicks it down well. A one-handed save. I think it was a that was a, a patch in and a effort there. That was one of the past favourite saves with the one hand. Who says Joe Fitzpatrick cannot make them either? Noel Keaton with the ball, pushes the ball down to Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins looks. Gerald Kennedy goes after him and puts it out for a throw. Joe once again makes another good save to keep his Arsenal side in it. Oh, good ball by James Kelly, only to find a little too high for Noel Keaton. Only to find a little too high for Noel Keaton to put it away. And it's a goal kick to Liverpool. Ali Gannon places the ball now for Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll looking up. Paul Carroll gives a good kick. George O'Gannon and Leamy stand to go for it. Noel Keaton gets the loose ball. Gives the ball away to Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy gives it away to James Kelly of Arsenal. James Kelly of Arsenal miscues completely and gives away a throw to Liverpool. Michal Duffy with the ball now. Up to George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon beats Eamon Stanton. Jojo goes, I think he was barged with the ball, but no whistle is gone. Eamon Duffy with the ball. Eamon beats Paul Ruddy. Goes around, takes a shot. No, Keaton blocks it down, but he gets the rebound. Kicks it too far for them. And it's a goal kick. And I see Chris Kelly with his hands on his head back at the uh, right-hand post as we're looking. I think in the little bit of this goes. Joe Fitz places the ball for Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton looks up, kicks to find James Kelly. James Kelly knocks it down to Mihal Duffy of Liverpool. Mihal Duffy of Liverpool puts it to George O'Gan in Liverpool. And Leamy Stanton of Arsenal kicks it away. A throw now to, to uh, Liverpool with Mihal Duffy. Mihal Duffy throws the ball up to Mihal Duffy. To George O'Gan and sorry. James Kelly puts it out and keeps it in. Eamon Duffy with the ball now. Good ball to uh, George O'Gan. George O'Gannon and George O'Gannon gets number two number two for uh, Liverpool George O'Gannon who scored the first one has pulled another one away on the balance of play I think if they have the edge it's not by a lot I see Tom Higgins placing the ball now James Kelly heads down Joe's having a bit of a laugh but the score is 2-1 uh, Paul Ruddy has a drive and it goes wide. I think on the balance of play, 
Arsenal might just deserve to be one or two ahead, but instead it's it's two one for Liverpool. And Paul Carroll the goal kick. Ball goes up. Nimi Stanton, Dougie Barry, Noel Keaton, Dougie falls, puts the ball down again. Paul Carroll, I think, wants to let it run up, but Tom Higgins keeps it well in play. Oh, Tom Higgins. And it's a throw to Arsenal. The score now is 2-1 for uh, Liverpool. Giorgio Gannon get both goals for Liverpool. And Paul Woody getting the only goal for Arsenal in the match so far. Waiting for the ball to be retrieved. There's a bit of a hill over there that when it goes down, she'll roll a fair bit. Paul is back on the field with Tommy Shudder with a throw for Arsenal. And it's gone out, and it's a throw for Liverpool with Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy with the throw now. To me, all Duffy. Me, all Duffy leaves it to Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan, a good ball to James Kelly. James Kelly pushes it. I think it's a kept in by Paul Carroll. And once again, it's gone into the gardens. Uh, they have the ball back, and I think they wait for the last. They wait for Christie again to come back to play. James Kelly with the corner <laughs> or the throw. I cannot see from here. There's a few people in the way. I think it's a corner. They're looking for. Uh, they're looking for somebody down there. There's some problem somewhere. <laughs> I think <laughs> I think uh, the lights have after getting bit going in for looking for the ball. <laughs> and uh, we're back at the play and it's a throw in to uh to li to uh, Liverpool. I think Christy Fitz was <laughs> got bit looking for the Going in looking for the ball, Ollie Gannon with the ball. Uh, Ollie kicks the ball up now to find uh, Giorgio Gannon. Giorgio knocks it on. Oh, no, Keaton knocks it on. Joe Fritz comes out. Joe takes it with no, no pressure at all. Kicks a good ball down. Finds Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins lets it go. Uh, Paul Carroll lets it run a bit and plays the ball off Tommy Sherder for a Liverpool throw. Quick throw to. Uh, to me all Duffy, me all Duffy to Eamon, Eamon back up and only finds Liam Stanton. Liam Stanton plays it back down again to find Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy plays it in and Ali prepared to let it go for a goal kick. Uh, in case you're late coming in, the third place playoff was won by Nottingham Forest, 4-2 the Bet Spurs. And the score here is 2-1 with a great individual goal by Paul Ruddy to open the score for Arsenal and George O'Gannon got a free with about seven minutes to go in the first half and he got a goal in the second half I think about 15 minutes gone back to the play now Jerk Kennedy with the ball and uh, kicks it kicks it wide uh, it's a goal kick to uh, Liverpool time ticking away now Looking for the ball to be uh, retrieved again. There's a bit of a hill back there, as I was saying. Uh, a goal kick now here, and Paul Carroll placing the ball. Paul Carroll looking up. Paul Carroll kicks. Finds Dougie Barry. Dougie lets it bounce over him. No keeping with the ball now. George O'Gannon going in after him. Uh, a throw to Liverpool. George O'Gannon with the ball now. Giorgio throws the ball to Eamon Duffy of Liverpool. Eamon knocks it back. Giorgio runs for the return. And Noel Keaton blocks well. The ball gone. Take him down there. It's gone, Fintan. 
Power going out to place the ball now for a corner for Liverpool. The score 2 1. Paul Power placing the ball. There's 1, 2, 3, 4. There's 5 Liverpool men in the Arsenal box. All the Liverpool men is back. Paul Carr puts in a good ball. Me or Duffy climbs well and me or Duffy scores. 3 1 now the score. Score 3 1. Me or Duffy climbs well to put the ball away. <laughs> Joe Fitz uh, took a little bit of a knock. Uh, there's a change of linesman. Uh, Damien Allen had to take over, take over for uh, Christy Fitzpatrick that got bit by a dog. Let's just hope it doesn't get a rabies or any of that kind of thing. Uh, Tom Higgins pushes the ball off, George again and takes it. Um, pushes the ball up to me, Old Duffy. Me, Old Duffy. Pushes the ball around Noel Keaton. Noel Keaton content to let you go for uh, a goal kick. Noel Keaton with the ball. Noel Keaton kicks the ball down, finds Tommy Sheridan. Tommy Sheridan. Pushes the ball down to Leamy Stanton. Leamy Stanton turns to beat Paul Carroll. Still has the ball. Tommy Shirley takes it off him. Only to find Jojo Gannon. Jojo sends it up. Finds Eamon Stanton of Arsenal. Eamon going through a good ball to find Paul Carroll didn't head it away. And he kicks it away. Kicks it away for a goal kick. Now here in this uh, Connor Mart seven side cup final with a goal kick to Liverpool with Paul Carroll kicking the ball out. Good ball into the Arsenal half to find me all Duffy, who in return just finds Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins kicks it down to find Tommy Sheridan of Arsenal. Arsenal uh, now trailing here with three goals. Three goals to one. Paul Carroll with the ball. Pushed a high ball across. Uh, a corner to uh, Arsenal. I think Leamy then to try to buck up his players and try to get them going a fair bit. James Kelly gone out to take the uh, take the corner. I think there has been a few missed chances for Arsenal. A bad corner, a bad corner, not like we saw in the first half. It's a goal kick to Arsenal. Uh, there's been a few chances gone big to Arsenal. They're 3-1 down. I think they've only themselves to blame at this stage of the game. Joe Fitz. Line up against the post as happy as Larry and his team losing. Paul Carroll takes a kick out. I don't know what he's tried to do, but it's a throw in to uh, Arsenal. I don't know what Paul Carroll had in mind. Ball ready, throws the ball to Leamy Stanton. Leamy Stanton beats Jerk Hinton. Goes down the far wing. Leamy Stanton beats him and Duffy. Pushes the ball across. But loses it to me, all Duffy. Uh, Jerk Kennedy just happy to kick it out. Chris Kelly with the ball. A throw to Arsenal, which. Uh, Eamon Stanton, Eamon throws the ball across to uh, his brother Leamy, Jojo hounding him there, but Leamy shields it and keeps it, a good ball through only to find me all the way in return to find Jojo again to kick it out for a throw into Arsenal. Leamy Stanton once again with the throw, this time throws it to Noel Keaton of Arsenal. Noel delays a little, got away with it, but just delayed two round and he could have put his team into trouble. And uh, It's another throw to Arthur after Amy Kinty feeling Amy Duffy to keep her in. No, Tommy shouted to Leamy Stanton. Leamy turns and Ali Gannon just takes it down. Good shot by Leamy outside the edge of the box. Ali told to kick up down and that's what he does. It's a good kick. Only to find uh, Shawnee Stanton to clear it. Back to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy beats two. He still has it. Paul Ruddy still has it. Me old Duffy closing in on him out but he's gone down but Paul Carroll is closing in. He is Back to me, Hall Duffy. Me, Hall Duffy, wishes. Yes. And it's gone in. Number four, a hat trick for Jojo Gannon. And the score is Liverpool for <laughs> Arsenal one. Jojo Gannon completing his hat trick with the other fourth goal coming from me, Hall Duffy. And the only individual goal score for Arsenal was Paul Ruddy, with a great individual goal that is open to score here today. Back to the play now, Paul Ruddy blocked down for the pass off, gets the rebound, takes it again, and it's gone out for a goal kick. Kick now with Paul Carroll here. Chris Kelly here beside me looking for a long ball. Paul Carroll kicks up a good ball, finds George O'Gannon, only to find Noel Keaton there to clear it out for a throw. 
McDuffie for Liverpool to throw to her, George again who gives it back to him. Aim it back to Mihal. Mihal pushes us all the way back to Joe Kindy. But Amy, Lee, Amy, Stan, Amy Stanton wins it only to give it away to Paul Carroll of Liverpool. Paul Carroll sends it back up and gives it back to Leamy again of Arsenal. Uh, Chris Kelly beats Leamy Stanton, but he does beat his brother Leamy. But Paul Carroll beats Tommy Sheridan over the far wing. Tommy Sheridan, good ball up to George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon takes it, pushes a good ball across to. Oh, Chris Kelly puts away number five in through Joe Fitzpatrick's legs. And it's number five, and Chris Kelly is showing his delight and good sportsmanship there, Paul Ruddy. She actually had a bit of a smile now. I think at this stage of the game, it's a bit one-sided. Joe is having a smile up there, I think. There's not a lot more he could do. A pass off now. Good ball down, but only to find uh, Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy in return finds Paul Carroll after the Liverpool team. Eamon takes the ball again at Paul Carroll. He's gone up the wing. Paul's gone up the whole way. Only to find James Kelly to stop him. <coughs> and here for Arsenal. And here standing beside me is Joe Kelly, one of the prominent young players of the under 10 squad. And it's a gone out again for another Arsenal throw. Arsenal now with Paul Ruddy and a great sportsmanship final here. But Paul just throws the ball out of play for a goal kick. The score is, if you're just after coming in, the score is Liverpool 5, Arsenal 1. Paul Ruddy scored the only Arsenal goal with George O'Gannon getting a hat trick for Liverpool. Michal Duffy and Chris Kelly putting the ice in on the cake. Paul Carroll is a kick out now to find Eamon Duffy. Eamon Duffy, oh, a mix up completely to find Tommy Sheridan to find Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy beats one. Paul Ruddy has a shot, but it's blocked. Eamon to find Paul Carroll. Paul Carroll takes it inside, going inside the Arsenal half to find George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon. Without finds Leamy Stanton, Leamy Stanton clears it away for an Arsenal throw. <laughs> and five minutes left here, and Tony Fitz having a smile over there on the far side after letting the ball go out. The ball back and play now with a Liverpool throw. Eamon Duffy going to take the Liverpool throw. He find, throws it to his brother Michal. Michal finds Paul Carroll coming inside the Arsenal half. Paul Carroll coming up, Chris Kelly on his own. George O'Gannon looking for it. A long ball, but it's wide. Wide. A goal kick to Arsenal. Joe Fitz standing over the ball, looking for Noel Keith to come in and take the goal kick. Uh, Joe still having a laugh up there. Noel Keith kicks out the ball. Finds Leamy Stanton. Jerk hit the. Eamon pushes it back to Ollie Gannon. Calling for a long ball. Ollie gives a ball up to find Dougie Barry. T Leamy Stanton further. Eamon clears it away. Eamon Duffy heads it back into George O'Gannon. James Gannon kicks away. He wants to get to Eamon. Eamon and me all having a bit of a mix up to find Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins pushes the ball down to Paul Ruddy. Paul Ruddy keeps it in play. Beats one. A late. Not meant tackle, but it's a free. I think it's the only second free or third free we had in the game. Third free, I think, to be exact, of the game. Noel Keaton with the ball now. Noel Keaton going to sit in this free kick. A good free kick. Ali Gannon can just pan it away, but me old Duffy clears it up. Paul Carroll, Dougie Barry up on his own here with Leamy Stanton. And Leamy Stanton prepared to clear it away. Uh, the score is. 5 1. The only scorer once again for the Arsenal team was Paul Ruddy. Three minutes left now here at this corner mark, seven aside final. Once again, third place playoff was won by uh, Pat Foley selection, four goals to two. Nottingham Forest Bet Spurs 4 2. Ali. Eamon Duffy throws in the ball now to me to George O'Gannon. George O'Gannon sends it across. Liam Stanton blocks it down. Uh, Eamon Duffy with the ball. Uh, Paul Ruddy kicks it with Noel Keaton with the ball now. I think he's happy enough to kick it out for a throw, and I cannot see what route. Eamon Duffy has the throw. Eamon Duffy throws it in to fight Liam Stanton. Liam Stanton does it clear. George O'Gannon has the ball. A bit of a tussle there. Me all Duffy with no. It's cleared out. I think off Tom Higgins. Paul Ruddy comes away with the ball. 
Paul Ruddy with the ball now. Paul kicks the ball down, only to find Jerry uh, Kennedy to head it away. It's an Arsenal throw. Time ticking away now for Arsenal. And once again, I look up at Joe Fitzpatrick, and he has a smile on his face. And goal kick now to Liverpool. Paul Carr with the goal kick. Joe Kelly is back here again to keep me company. Paul Kerr kicks out the ball to find Tom Higgins. Tom Higgins takes it down. He's gone inside the Liverpool half to find Tommy Shaw. A bit of a mix up between Tommy Shaw and Leamy Stanton, but Leamy Stanton comes away with it. Leamy with the ball now. Leamy pushes a good ball to Paul Ruddy. Paul does to take advantage of it. Uh, Ali does it collect it cleanly, but he has it. Kicks the ball up to Jojo Gannon. Jojo. Pushes the ball to James Kelly. James Kelly kicks it away. Good play by James Kelly. I see Pat Foley looking at us. He's watching now. We make it. Half a minute to go of normal time. Bad ball by Leamy Stanton. And Miall Duffy doesn't do an awful lot with it. Paul Ruddy has it now. Paul, a good ball. And Paul Carroll kicks it out. And it's all over, and the final result is Liverpool 5, Arsenal 1. The only scorer for Arsenal was Paul Ruddy, with uh, three goals coming from George O'Gallon, one from Eol Duffy and one from Chris Kelly for the Liverpool team. Uh, third place playoff was won by Pat Foley's selection, Forrest Pittsburgh's uh, 4-2. And now we'll have the presentations in a few minutes. Uh, I see Ollie Gannon. Getting a fair old bit of <laughs> victory. Uh, uh, seven aside team, Mr. Ali. Ali, can we have a, a few words here? How do you think it went? I like Tosh. Uh, in the second half, we we were the better team. We really got we really uh, got on top of them. And uh, when Jojo was pushed us two one up. I knew that our that was the goal that relaxed our team. It gave us more confidence, and we produced the goods. Then, uh, uh, Georgia scored a, a hat trick. Did, did yeah. you did you think it would have been a well? We see a one-sided affair as it was. Uh, no, I thought the, uh, it'd be uh, the same as it was in the first half. The boys really putting pressure on our backs, but uh, fortunately for us, they didn't. Then, as you saw yourself, the result went the right way for my, for my concern anyways. I think you played very well Ali. Uh, Paul Ruddy's goal was a, a fairly good goal for a Nottingham uh, goal. Uh, uh, no, not well, not taking away from Paul but I have myself to blame for that too. Even though Michal uh, passed the ball back that was short, uh, I took my eye off it when I came out. So I blame myself just as much for the, for their goal. Uh, have you anything to say about your opposition <coughs> number, Joe Fitz, uh, the other goal? I'd like to sympathise with Lamey Stanton and Joe Fitz uh, in particular, whose birthday was yesterday. And uh, I know Joe was hoping that this a win today would be his birthday present, but n you never know, in the future, he might have a win. Okay? Ali, congratulations, and Thank I you. suppose we'll have a bit of a seat out tonight. Uh, Thank, Thank you. you. Uh, losing captain here, Liam Stanley. First of all, can I uh, sympathise with you? I think uh, you played very well. What went wrong? I don't know. We were very good in the first half, but fell apart in the second half. Uh, Paul Rudy got a great goal for you. I thought myself you had the edge all right in the first half. Fell asleep. Fell asleep. <laughs> it's about the size of it. Uh, Threw it away in the second half. Missed chances. Loads of them. Uh, <laughs> any you want to recap on for Not us? Not a thing. I don't want to play it again <laughs> anyway. It was a good... It was a good game. It was a very good game, and the boys deserve it. And that good sporting game. Good sporting game. Not one bad tackle in it. I, I see James Kelly here. James, I think he's the uh, youngest player we have uh, in the final here today. James, you had a good game. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. Uh, are you uh, disappointed with the result? Are you happy with the way you played yourself? Well, uh, I'm happy the way I played, but they deserve to win. It's as simple as that. Uh, do you think you had a, you missed any missed chances? I thought you given a few great corners in the first half. W one or two in the second half was the two good. No, I think after they got the fourth one, I think they gave up four balls together. You gave up four balls together. Wasn't the, the worst thing. Come back and get five goals. No way. Well, it was a bit of an uphill battle, wasn't it? Yeah. Thanks, James. Thanks very much.
Uh, today is a very special day in, uh, with the Car and the Marth residents and with the sports department of Car and the Marth. And it gives me great pleasure as vice chairman of this organisation to be here today to welcome you all on this occasion. This is indeed is a, a very u unique occasion because today we're here to honour one of our own, a man who in my estimation done an awful lot for this part of the town. He was to me a, a great man in an awful lot of ways, he was a great family man, he was a great Irish man and he was a great Westport man, a great father and a great neighbour. And I have here with me today uh, his daughter Anne Morden, uh, formerly Anne Gannon, and I have also Celsus Gannon. I'm surrounded by Gannons here, and there's a few Kellys and, and all in between. But in any way, ladies and gentlemen, this cup that you see here before you today will be played for in years to come. And in that way, the name of, of Bloody Gannon will always be remembered in Westport and in this area. And I am very proud to be here today to, to do these honours. And I wish to thank uh, a few people here, because without them, of course, we'd have no uh, sports at all, or we'd have no football match. And they are our generous sponsors. And as you can see here in front of you, we have an, a, a beautiful array of trophies from fourth to first. And I think every single one of them is beautiful. And uh, I wish now to call, first of all, on the fourth captain, John Doyle, to receive his trophies. Tommy Doyle, sorry. Tommy Doyle to receive his trophies. Tommy. Okay. The Tommy Doyle now receive a third place trophies from uh, Mrs. Ann Gannon. Tommy Doyle, captain of the third four team, accepts his trophy. Charlie Keaton. Mr. Francie Gannon, son of the man that we're here for today. John Welch, the goalie who had a furry, who had a great game. Francie Gannon is receiving Michael Higgins and John Jagorishis that couldn't be here with us for the presentation of the trophies. Patrick Gannon, who played as well. And John Morton, John Morton Jr. Mr. Patrick Gannon is going uh, accepting it. Third place. Third place places. Mr. Damien Gannon, captain of the third team, accepts his trophy from Ann Morton or Ann Gannon. Mr. Pat Foley, the referee who took charge of the, the final and who also played in the third place playoff. Mr. Peter Foley, your brother of Pats, who played a goal. I think he had a, an injury to his leg, who had a very good game and goal. Mr. Golden Boot himself, Mr. Leo Durkin, accepts his trophy. Seamus Burke, who had a very good game. Mr. Ned McHale, uh, one of the sponsors from Sally O'Brien. Uh, Jim Lally, who took a knock during the game, receives his trophies. First of all, now I think. We'd have the man, man of the match award. So, could we have, uh, can we have the man of the match? Who, who, did the linesman decide who the man of the match was? Oli Gannon! Oli Gannon! Oli Gannon! Oli Gannon! Okay, right. Who's man of the match? Okay, right. Well, we we'll go on to so to uh, second place. Second place, the f second runners up of the Beamy Stanton of the runners up team, uh, Mr. Noel Keaton, Thomas Higgins, James Kelly, Tommy Fahey, Joe Fitzpatrick, Paul Woody received their trophies from Mr. Paul Kelly uh, for being runners up at the seven aside final. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I think we'll have man of the match. I think it has been decided. Man of the match award goes to. 
Mr. Thomas Higgins has won the award, Miss Man of the Match. Man of the Match award goes to Mr. Thomas Higgins, loser finalist at the. Mr. Uh, Porrick Kelly, Thomas Higgins, and Nan Morton, who presented the trophies. Man of the match. Now we have the uh, finalist team to come up to receive this immaculate trophy. There's another presentation to be made here, so don't go away. It's an individual award to be made. I can't say anything about it now at the moment. So now we're going to have the big moment now. The cup now and the winner. The victorious captain comes up, Mr. Ali Gannon, to receive this trophy. Mr. Ali Gannon receives the trophy. Ali. Receives his trophy from Miss Ann Morton. Uh, Mrs. Salshock Gannon uh, goes in to the, the forces as well, Miss Ali Gannon. Paula Kelly and uh, 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 Mr. Paul Kelly and Mort Ali Gannon, captain of the victory team, Mr. Tony Fitzpatrick and his little child and Mrs. Gannon, all part of the committee and organisation from the Chris team. Mr. Chris Kelly receives his trophy after scoring the number five goal in the cup final. Mr. Dougie Berry, who's played very well. Mr. Dougie Berry comes up to receive his trophy. Dougie Barry comes up with a smile on his face. Mr. Ger Kennedy comes up to receive his trophy from Miss Ann Morton. Mr. Paul Carroll, who played a very strong part of this victorious team here today, comes up to receive his trophy. Mr. Eamon Duffy, a brother of, of Michal Duffy's, who comes up to receive his trophy here today from Miss Ang, Mrs. Moran or Miss Gannon. <laughs> Mr. Michal Duffy, a brother of, uh, of Eamon comes up to receive his goal and he got number four goal here today. Mr. Giorgio, Mr. Giorgio Gannon, who scored his hat trick, receives his trophy of his of his sister. Now ladies and gentlemen, uh, Reverend Father, I have another award here, but before I make this award, I, I think I have missed very important people all together, which we could have no matches, of course, at all without. And there is the referee and the referees and the linesmen. And I'd like to say a very sincere word of thanks to those people as well. And uh, the boy, the ball boys. And there's, <coughs> there's another gen there's a there's a, an, 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 another gentleman here in the crowd. I see him here, and I'd like to mention him because he always uh, facilitates us in every way possible. And that is Brother Mikhail there. He's very good to us any time. So we go in. Now, ladies and gentlemen, uh, I have another special award here. Now, this award is for a man who I have great time for. A man who has done an awful lot for the sports here in Cahan Mart. And indeed, he happens to be a very good friend of everybody here in Cahan Mart. He has worked tirelessly for the past six leagues and given sterling service to Cahar Namart and all kinds of sports up here. He's involved in all kinds of sports in Westport and he's a credit, I think, to Cahar Namart. Now, I refer to my old and very good friend there, Tony Fitzpatrick. Yeah. And, and I, 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 
I, I'd ask him to come along and receive this. Mr. Tony uh, Fitzpatrick comes up to present to receive a special trophy to him for his uh, dedication and trof and to the sport in the area. And he goes up now to receive his trophy from Miss Anne Gannon uh, for his service and dedication to the, the Football Association up here. He's doing well. I don't know if I have loads of friends in the mass I'm involved in a lot of sports. What do you think? What do you do this for, lads? Why not? Correct. Sorry. Okay, let's go. Yeah, Brenda, you hold it. That's a good girl. I'd like to I'd like to say uh, something else. Uh, Mrs. Gannon, that's Mrs. Molly Gannon. Uh, uh, told me to say a few words to you today. She apologises for not being here and uh, she couldn't be here for her own reasons. But her daughter Anne is here and I think it would be only appropriate that this lady would say a few words to us. Yeah. Thanks very much, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to thank you all very much for attending this match today and to the Cahernamorth Estate for all the hard work they've done on the pitch and for the lads who played in the match on both sides, both the winning team and the losing team. A big round of applause for the losing team. Yeah. And a bigger round of applause for the winning team. Yeah. Thank you all very much. Thanks very much, Anne. Thanks very much, ladies and gentlemen. We'll have a, a small bit of a function after in, in uh, Sally O'Brien's. Uh, and if anybody cares to see the match and video, it's there. So thank you all again for coming along. And the victory team starts the lap of honor. And uh, Mr. Chris Kelly and the captain Ollie Gannon takes the cup on its lap off the field. Goal to after passing where they defended so well in the second half. Huh? Coming up to the goal where they scored their, their five.